Pisces. Hello, Pisces. How are you today? Pisces, I'm here to do your March 2017 astrology reading. Thank you for tuning in. Please call me for your own personal readings at 818-985-2010, 818-985-2010. For PayPal Mondays, please email me at psychictracybrown at yahoo.com. Tracy is spelled T-R-A-C-E-Y. Subscribe and press the notification button. Please join me on Instagram and Twitter. What is around Pisces? Pisces, what is around you for the month of March? Please uh, talk to me about Pisces. Seems to be a halo. I wonder if I saw a halo with Pisces just now. <clears throat> Sometimes when I close my eyes, I get these visions, and I'm wondering if I saw a halo. If I saw a halo, Pisces, you might take this month to take on a martyr's role. may not be real. It's just kind of what you want people to see you as, like this perfect, adorable, you know, gracious, you know, male or female martyr. Look at me. Look at me. I'm doing everything. It might be true. I'm not going to take it from you. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Make it good. I like you. So I'm going to go for you. Make it good. Okay. <clears throat> Pisces, there's something you're going to have to go after. Be aggressive when you do it. Nobody is going to mind the aggressiveness of your nature. You don't show it anyway. <coughs> To me, this feels like a job. <coughs> Go for it, Pisces. When I turn the cards around, there's some sibling energy that's important here, and I want to make sure that you all are investing in your siblings. Invest in your siblings, guys, okay? Sorry. There is money around you, um, Pisces. There might be some love issues that's going to come up for you, Pisces, and maybe a little bit of a broken heart. Out of all the signs, Pisces is the one that believes in love and constantly invests in love and constantly finds themselves in a situation where love escapes them. It's the one sign, all right? So it looks like something's going to come up for the month of March. And for Pisces, <clears throat> in this case, it just looks like Whatever love interest was there, they were just there for the winter time. Like, it was a hibernating period. They didn't want to be alone. They were there for the winter. Now the snow is starting to thaw out. And now your, your partner seems to want to go where the sun leads him or her. So, Pisces, you guys take everything personally. I see you crying. I am so sorry. It is very well going to happen extremely, extremely quickly. Again, I know I'm going back and forth between love and job, but love comes up. <clears throat> One minute, job comes up the next minute. Please, Pisces, there seems to be something you need to go after. It's down the line, or it's up there, or it's a struggle to get there. Sometimes it means taking a test, applying for that job. Sometimes it could mean a job that's in a different location than where you're at right now. I'm really, really getting with these two cards that you kind of need to apply for it and go for it. Apply for it and go for it. Because there's so much more better out there for you that will allow you to have more money in your pockets. Could involve <clears throat> training, close attention to detail, this job, much more rigorous um, stance in your position. Um, could mean more mental agility, which sometimes you Pisces, you don't have the mental agility. You guys are so glad to just to show up and kind of be present at a job and hoping nobody notices how much you daydream. In this case, it's mental agility. So it's the type of job that will get you out of the water, deep down inside that ocean, and have you have much more of an experience with life and activity so that you're not thinking so hard or so hard inside your emotions. Maybe it doesn't necessarily have to do <clears throat> with more money, 
But again, Pisces, you're that type of person. You're the type of person to take on a job and not get more money for it. But it still will be a really, really good position, even though a lot of money isn't attached to it. Because the position will... Re Taking a position will, re will request bigger, bigger changes. Huge, huge changes. Even though it doesn't look like it could create massive change in your work life, in how you decide how you deal with the rest of your life. But it's huge. So own it and do it and take care of it. Apply, follow, study, do whatever it takes, Pisces. Because I feel like you're going to get the offer. This offer will create some conflict. Work it out. You're not to stay stuck. Work it out. It will create some conflict, but oh well. It may show up in about four to six weeks in terms of getting the answer that you need um, and making some decisions that's going to be good and correct for you and your family. Um, again, moving forward, just for Pisces, there's just something here that tells me it mandates change. You kind of don't want to do it, but you kind of have to. And it involves getting on a journey, a new journey, a new... It's kind of like leaving high school and going to college. It's kind of like leaving your mom's house and getting your own apartment and and the, and taking a job that's that's closer. Just do it, Pisces. No fear. Fear is not allowed, and nor is fear an option. I believe in you. Please take care of yourself and do whatever it takes to create a better life. No self-sabotaging antics, Pisces. The one thing I have to say about you is that you will revert back to old patterns and then say, it wasn't my fault. I just couldn't survive out there. It wasn't me. Pisces, be stronger than that. You're better than that. All right, guys, I better get up out of here. Thank you for tuning in. This is Psychic Tracy Brown. Please call me for private readings at 818-985-2010. Email me, psychictracybrown at yahoo.com. Follow me on Instagram. Subscribe to YouTube, Twitter, and press that notification button. Thank you, guys. Bye.